I hope you can see them. These are sandhill cranes. There's three of them. There's two to the left and one to the right. And I like these birds for many reasons. Number one, uh, they mate for life. So the male and the female come together and they have a baby. It's usually only one baby. And they stay together even after they bring up this baby. Now, if you can see, uh, on the left side, there's the, I think it's the mother and the baby. Now, the baby is actually really tall now. Uh, people at this, where I work, one of my jobs, mm, they watch this baby grow up. It used to be really, really tiny. Um, but now it's almost exactly as tall as the mother and father, but it still isn't mature. Um, and I personally think it's, you could tell when it's mature when it actually grows the red around its eyes. But what usually happens here, sorry, that was loud, whenever um, they go out and eat, you know, they pick with their beaks in the ground and they find little bugs and then they eat them. Whenever they do this, usually one bird, I think it's the father on the right, he stands and has a, he's the lookout. Right now he's cleaning himself, but there he is, he's looking at me now. Um, but another thing about them is that they will do everything that they can to save and protect this baby. Uh, I work right over here, like the building over there is where I work, and look at him stretch. He's got a long wingspan. Look at him, he's balancing on one foot. He's showing off. Um, but they're very protective. Um, there's coworkers of mine that would be walking to the entrance of the, the building and these birds would be near the entrance and they would think that, you know, the individual is coming towards their baby. So they'll actually run after this person who's walking. And I'm actually getting really close. I should watch out because they might attack me. <laughs> but what they'll do is use their beaks and uh, poke you. But if I do come too close, they'll let me know. They'll start walking over towards me. I think that's what, I don't know, the father probably is doing. But these are actually really tall birds. You probably can't tell. He's cleaning himself. I don't know if you're picking it up on the noise, but there's noise that he's making. But they, they seem to they seem to uh, be okay with me being right here, and that's why I love I love trying to get up close. Although I know it's it's actually not good for them because if they learn to trust humans that might not be good for their survival. Some humans will just, you know, shoot them and eat them. <laughs> but who would want to eat a, a sandhill crane? Look at, he's balancing. You see that? Now he's stretching his wing out. That's just for you guys, man. He's like, look what I can do. Look what I can do. I know, this is probably really boring to anybody who doesn't like birds or nature. <laughs> but I could do this all day. Look at that, that's the, the son or the daughter, the baby, is standing up straight. And you probably can't tell because of the shade, but he doesn't have the redness uh, around his eyes. Hi. He's coming over to me. He's like, who are you? I wish you guys could see this. I think I'm going to stop because I don't think you could see them. But those are my sandhill cranes. They're not mine, but they're sandhill cranes that visit us at work. Bye, sandhill cranes! <laughs>